Have you ever, like, Gigi Allen got naked performing? When I perform for my lady. Ba boom. <laughs> the illest hour radio show. What the fuck? W H? Bro, you talk about my high school. W H F H. Jalen the illest. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? How? Narwar, how? How do you? Well, you are Juice World. We have to know. Is this where it all started? Right here with the rump shaker. <laughs> Pharrell, is this where we started? Pharrell Williams, the rump shaker. Yeah. This is this is this is one of the most impressive interviews I've ever experienced in my life. Seriously. Oh well, thank you so much. It's great to be able to talk to you guys. This is this is insane, man. Your research is second to none. Second to none. And I can only imagine that you're, you probably do the same kind of research with every band that you interview. So that's it's pretty impressive, man. Ugly God. Quote, sad dad, young. Pussy baker. Hermit. Crab. Wait, hold up. How you know that? Young Hermit Crab. How you know about that? My rap name. Oh, my gosh. I was young Hermit Crab for a week. For a week, and you know this. Wow. You remember that? Your manager at McDonald's, what rap group was he in? I don't know, but I know exactly what you're talking about. I don't know. I don't, he, I don't remember, but I know what you're talking about. I don't remember. And he showed his trunk? I, bro, how the fuck do you know that, bro? You love malls. Ah, uh, not really. Like garden malls in Florida. Garden malls. Ah, uh-huh, shit. <laughs> what can you tell the people about this VHS cassette right here? I was curious. Did you put this out? Oh my god! This is what the fuck I've been trying to find. My Smoke Fest Volume 1. This is the first one I ever put out, cuz. Look, this is the first one that I put out. This is my first movie that I directed, put up the money for, shot it. See what it say on the back? Writer, director, and executive producer, Snoop Doggy Dog. You don't even have a copy yourself? No, I don't. Paul Mason, did he introduce you at age four to a Jay-Z beat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to that's like my uncle. Shout out to him. That's crazy. How do you? What the fuck? <laughs> oh no! I was like, how does he know that? That's crazy though. We have right for you, little Uzi, a Rob Zombie poster. Why'd you even pull this out? I really like this movie, but why'd you pull this out? I know this from last time. You know this, so everybody know this. But how do you know this? Well, you a little Uzi Vert. We have to know it. I'm glad I'm a good guy, because if I was under investigation for something, I'd be scared right now. How you know that? They don't even know that. I don't even talk to them about that. Guns Garcia. Yo, he know too much. I can't do this. What Kanye do? Little Uzi. Lil Uzi first. Do, 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 do. Dude, dude, your Aunt Betty did security? What the fuck? How the fuck you know this? God damn. Bro, you the feds, bro? Bro, this is, dog, I don't know if you're a fucking police or you're just a really good ass journalist because my mind is fucking blown right now. Chauncey. Dog, you even know niggas from my block? Whoa! Oh, I'm done. Yo! Denso Curry. Yo! Yo! Hell no! Oh, damn! Motherfucking chain. <laughs> a chain. And I was thinking, Mr. Ferg, chains. You make the chains. Oh, sh- wow. That's good he know that. That was so long ago. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I used to make chains. I used to make jewelry. <laughs> and I guess I was curious, ASAP, what is the importance of the Black Ink Gallery? 
Um, wow. How the fuck do you know about the Black Ink Gallery? Okay, Black Ink Gallery is a tattoo shop in Harlem where we all used to just hang out at 113th. Is it true logic they used to rap at the Joe's Chicken Crab Shack? Joe's Crab Shack, yes. So you rapped and you worked at it? What was those clips of you rapping at a Crab Shack? Yeah, man, I, uh... Damn, not what fuck, man. You're also digging the modern sounds of war paint, aren't you? Dude! How the fuck do you know? How do you know this, bro? How do you know? Oh, my God. Well, your logic, we have to know. You also delivered pizza to Killer Mike, right? <laughs> what? Yes, 100%, 100%, yes. Okay, why, do you, why do you know this? Well, you are jit. We have to know. Thank you, Stephanie. <laughs> <laughs> Hazel Stern <laughs> Stephanie And you were at her house watching TV Thank you Stephanie That's fucking weird She taught me about anime What happened? I didn't know that Well you were real nasty We have to know That's a little bit sus And who is your friend right there? Camilla Ca yeah, How do you know? <laughs> dude, you are how do you know her name dude? You like Alice Coltrane I do I do And the Dresden Dolls I know, oh yes, I. What the? <laughs> How do you know that? That's look. Listen, all the other questions. Since now, I've been like this. He just looked up my Google or whatever. Bro, how do you know Dresden dolls? Well, you were a Doja Cat. We have to know. Fair, but he was a producer. Yeah, he was. Oh no, he he was a dancer. My brother was a producer. My my dad's a dancer. But he also did producing and rapping. For instance, right on this cassette, right here, Mercy. If we turn it over, what do we see on the back? Produced by... <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? I didn't know that. Damn. Produced by... My dad, Dumasani Dlamini. That is crazy, bro. What about GMB Studios? GMB Studio, they my dog, Sean B. How the fuck you know this? How? Hold on, bro. How? How you... I'm saying... How, like, talk to me, bro. You the police? Is you the LBI? CIA? What's you? You are black youngster. We have to know. Because it was at an OJ Dajusman gig that you met Zaytoven. Yeah. Nah, I met Zaytoven. I met Zaytoven. Oh. Yes, it was. Oh, obsession. You tripping. Two man had a show. We met him at the, on the side and we tapped. And we tapped out. You tripping. In the club. Obsession. The first time we ever seen him. The first time we ever seen Zay was in Obsession. To Zay. But you got some. You got a hell of a research, bro. I ain't know that. I forgot that. Amigos, we gotta know. This is a lady that you love, isn't it, right here? <laughs> I love this woman more than... Is this autographed? It is. Is this for me? Uh, actually, I think it says to Nardwar, does it? Oh, it's, <laughs> I don't know. I just thought... I just, wow, this is amazing. Who is this right here? This is Pam Greer. This is Pam Greer, coffee. Pam, yeah, this is coffee. And this right here, this woman, like, oh, man, this is going to sound so weird. But when I first discovered what masturbation was, I used to jerk off to... Um, to Pam Greer. And now you have Cherokee. <laughs> oh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, I don't necessarily. <laughs> what about the rest of your family? For instance, your sister has a shoe store in Jacksonville? You're getting deep now. You're getting deep. You know, I keep my family out of these conversations. You're getting deep. You're getting, you're not, listen, we're going. I, I, big up to my family. Big up to big up to my whole family. We, I, I got. I can't. I can't put. You're getting deep. You're getting too deep. I, I, I like you. Like chill. Out. Let's not get too deep now, please. You, yo, you're not the people, right? Like, <laughs> Did Biggie ever hear your beat? I get. Damn. You, you know, this man, how this man know? This man crazy. <laughs> Has your uncle at one time, did he run hip hop, fish, and chicken in Tallahassee? Yeah, you know, how you be knowing all this stuff? It's been, I'm going to keep the family stuff out. This, but but you good, man. I like you. Man. Do you know a guy called Cannon? Day. You heard that? Cannon? Oh, shit. That's Please explain. Yeah, that's crazy. This dude said cannon. Wow. That's crazy. Cannon. That's one of the dudes I started rapping with. My dude Antonio. Yeah. Wow. That's eight grade. That's seven grade. What about Louisiana chicken? <laughs> that's the, yeah, Louisiana chicken. That's the neighborhood. Yeah. That's my that's my favorite 
Yeah. And it's like bulletproof glass? Yeah. 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 What do you order there? I ordered the number three. It's a three piece with the fries and the lemonade. And Kendrick Lamar, there's also Tams and Rite Aid, too. The Rite Aid. Definitely grew up in Tams and Rite This dude right here is really doing his research, though. This dude is crazy. <laughs> Little Wayne, what about food? Have you ever considered or been approached by the Rap Snacks Company? Because here's some Rap Snacks. Miss Toy, a rapper, it was on the Up and Smokes tour. She has her own Rap Snacks, and the big timers had Rap Snacks chips too. They sure fucking did. Baby and them had their own chips, the big timers chips. They really did. They, they did. Sour cream and dill. I don't remember the flavor, but they had their own rap snacks. You're not lying. Keep on rocking in the free world and do 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 do. do, do.